Hello there everyone and welcome back to the Old Road Blues series in which we're playing as Dredgers. Um, right now we're War of the Broken Coast and we don't have as many divisions as they do. They've suffered more casualties than us, but uh, we do have a few guys here willing to help us out just a, just a wee bit. Um, and they are basically the people who we signed as pack with earlier off screen. Unbroken Resistance Pack Sovereignty. So we people from North Coover. Um, who else do we have? North Coover, or Coover, Olympus Tribe, and New Victoria. Olympus Tribe. Huh. Oh, they're right here. I didn't realize Olympus Tribe was still alive. Well, go figure. Huh. They're a puppet of New Victoria. Oh, okay. Well, anyways, um, we're going to try to go in and see what we can do, because their divisions are all over the place, quite literally. So, we might get some opportunities to make some encirclements, and if it doesn't go well... Well, there's always a save button or lo the load button, so we'll see. Um, in the meantime, because they, they, they've sent a lot, they sent a lot of divisions. So if we can actually encircle some of these dudes, I think that'd be real bueno. I don't want you to move that way. All right, if anything, I want you to move right there. Oh, or actually, uh, we'll see what we can do because our allies are all over the place. So, yeah. Our guys are literally all over the place. Um, I don't want to fight their navy because their navy is probably relatively decent. We are okay on energy cells. Yeah, they've got quite a few things. And we have no capital ships. So, yeah. There's that. Maintenance efficiency is good as well. Ooh, more defense breakthrough. Because we did throw these guys on our robot divisions. So we'll see what happens. Um, if it doesn't go well, like I said, then so be it. Just do what you can. Well, now we still have no manpower. Um, we probably should course in this territory. Because it is getting kind of hard to do all this stuff and go be at war as well. So a little more manpower would be very nice. I haven't lost any divisions yet, which is good. You're heading through there, that's good. So yeah, using robots maybe wasn't the smartest idea, but it was definitely a decision. Followers, yeah, help us out. Our industry's okay though. It is quite okay. And we've been pushed back all the way over here. Oh great. As their divisions are just like, they, they keep leaving their fronts. I don't understand, so. But we'll go back to the drawing board to see if there's anything else we can do about this war. And here we are at, as you can see, our volunteers are going to town on quite a few of these guys, actually. Um, but in the meantime, we're going to go ahead and see if we can attempt to uh, do okay here. Yeah, well, look at that. I really don't want to do this because our robots are just, ju some of these divisions are just absolutely destroyed. My god, using robots was probably not a smart decision, but... I haven't used the robot robotic doctrine in a long time, and I figured, you know what, might as well, because when's the last time I've actually used them? It's been super long. I did court a few more states just so it would be easier for us, but once Broken Coast is gone, we should be decent on manpower and factories and stuff like that, so I'm not super concerned, but just, ugh, my god. We've, take, we've destroyed a couple divisions, but our volunteers have destroyed quite a few as well. Uh, but we're still making more, and we did throw on some heavy lifter robots here too, so there goes the failed successor. Um, anything here we really care about? Not too much. Firefighter fire protection? Sure, why not? You know, go, go to town. Special Forces still do very well, though. Even though I need to make sure that they actually have the correct armor. Which would be pretty nice if they did. Oh, we do the Cypher on as well. I forgot about that. That we just researched, or stole, or cracked, or whatever, however you want to call it. And then we might go to war with North Cooper, maybe. We'll see. Um... Let's see, not bad, not bad, not bad. The other guys just really suck. There you go. Get a little bit of strength now. You anything there, maybe? Rolls go, baking powder. More base, I guess, maybe. Of course, doing this does cost quite a bit of energy, so. You know, unless you have a lot of energy, a good industrial base to really use robots, I wouldn't really recommend ever using them, but, like I said, every once in a while, So all we need is North Cooper last. You might be able to take it, maybe, maybe not. Be 
be kind of cool if you could. Especially since we broke their ciphers. And of course they're doing force defense, so you know, I'll force the attack. Fair is fair. How are we doing over here? Six, huh? There you go. Well, that's looking a lot better now. Over here it's looking like a giant mess, but you know what? This is old world blues. Get used to it. This is Hearts of Iron 4. Um, we can do this one. I'm going to save it. Brick housing is not bad. Let's see. Construction. Quite a bit ahead of time. And... Ah, the broken coast gun! Thank God! Jesus Christ! They have, like, nothing left. What I really want. Oh, thank you for all of that. Oh, my goodness. Beautiful. So that in mind... Let's see what this is like. Because we need some time to, like, rearrange things. So let's save real quick. And I want to form Cascadia, and then we will form British Columbia, perhaps? Oh, we also got this place up here, too. That's nice. Actually, if anything, we might want to go to war with those guys first, perhaps. It might be the easiest to take them out. Maybe? Maybe not? Let's take a look see, though. So let's form Cascadia first. So we'll be known as Cascadia. Get 25% more stability, which we don't really actually need. Everyone else gets uh, one infrastructure and 250 more people uh, gain a core. Nice. So now we're Cascadia. Cool. And I want you guys to come up here. Is this a good idea or a bad idea? Honestly, it's probably a bad idea. You guys actually might be able to do this. Okay, like. Well, we'll see. If we need to build another um, port, well, we might as well go ahead and do that. Broken masks, goodbye. There you go. One on each one. A few more factors would be nice, especially for this stuff over here, and then some more over here. And iBots, yes, please. Still might get some of this other stuff that we don't really need too much of. Honestly, at this point, uh, we are using saws and basic stuff like that for our special forces. So let's give it a moment. So we're going to do that. So we'll go to war. So we have all this core. So I did core a little bit. Oh, we actually have a decent force now. Nice. Here. Head out. It's not bad. Better Pioneer kits are good as well. Let's grab some of this too. Ooh, well, we are going to be running out of things to build. Nonsense. Absolute nonsense. Firefighter protection is good too. Build more of this up all around this entire area here. Uh, this is resources. So at this point, we'll do okay in the campaign. We got 3,000 manpower, which is still not very much, but for an area like this, kind of expected. Okay, do that too. Because why not? So we do this. We can go to war Mia. Let's get some more organization first, perhaps. Yes. So for you guys, half you guys, honestly, just combine. Our guys are just not strong at all. And at this point, throw in a little bit more and throw in one more as well. Because it hurts what? It hurts your organization a little bit, but not much. It gives you more initiative, heart attack, soft attack, breakthrough, defense, a, a lot more HP actually, a little bit more armor too. So that's when you come with, that's going to really help us out here. Um, so that's good. Uh, encourage women to serve. Let's go with this one. Recon is okay for now. Uh, pioneer kits. What else we got around here? Uh, maybe some better guns. Basic laser weaponry sounds decent to me. Clothing production is good too. More base is okay. Maybe not fantastic, but it is okay. Can we do okay here? Now I knew they would start attacking us immediately, but it depends how long it takes. Because I would like to take out Coover perhaps as well. We'll try to grind these guys out as much as we possibly can. And here we're at. Coover has been assaulted by the Brotherhood. And so we're going to go in anyway. We're also at war with New Victoria. We are New Columbia. So overall, not bad. We'll take as much as we can of Coover, but we'll see actually how much we actually get in the end. Hope we get enough. Because I'd love to have a lot of them under us. Which would be the most ideal thing possible. Of course, we're also trying to fight over the water. Kind of sucks. And we're just defending here too against uh, New Victoria, but we'll see how much we actually get in the end. Uh, here we go, do that. Ooh, low trade influence, huh? We got a lot of air XP, don't we? Um, there we go. I don't want our defenses. Take attack. That was a little different, nice. And we're gonna go and grab. Uh, which one do we want? Robotics wise? Outsider Warfare, Mutants and Behemoths, probably not. Asymmetric, I mean, it would help our army overall. 
wasteland tactics, but we don't have militia. Locals. Does locals include robots? I don't think so. Army, army, it's not bad. Does, what does infantry include? It, it doesn't include uh, robots, does it? No, it doesn't, so. More max speed, frontline platoons. Does include robots. So, army, that's not bad. Infantry organization. This more organization overall. Army breakthrough, army speed. Recovery rate, experience soldiers losses. And principles. Hardness, which would actually pair well with how hard we are already. Power armor, we don't have any power armor. We have light special forces, but not heavy special forces. Uh, I might just go for refined warfare. Flexibility movement, maybe? There we go. Finally, another special forces division. We may or may have not lost one division on the already, but whatever. Learn, Stephen Mitchell, learn, yes, ding dong. There you go. Go, 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 go. Taking robotic warfare. Got a couple brigs. Paddle steamer. Oh crap, we're actually losing energy cells. Get even more if you can, that's fine. Nice. Go in and do whatever you can. Oh, they navel invaded or repair drop? Probably navel invaded it, though. Do we lose anything here? No. Good. And we'll take scavenging teams. Nice. Quite a few divisions around here. They've done 13%. Take going in. Nice. A couple more robots. Would be pretty good too. I set these guys up so we would get attacked, but I guess not. And we're doing the air doctrine. Go figure. Bayou motor is gone. Basic smelteries. Do that one. Basic pumps. Boundaries. Nice. There we go. All right. This would really piss them off. Oh, that's really gonna, yeah. Nice. They might start to against us, which is probably what's going to happen. You guys have to do that, okay, that's fine. Back in. You guys are gonna do this too. Let's see if we can shove our way out through here. But we'll see. Trying to land more divisions over here. Good. And start doing some of that. And start doing some of this and that. And maybe start using the theme for New Victoria. Cypher, I should say. Nice. Should be fine. 87, 88, maybe 89, yeah. They an okay amount of damage, they have 10 planes in total. And they are attacking us again. Nice. Oh. Oh, would you look at that? A couple of these scenes going. Some scavenging teams. Some think tank. A shift work. Nice. 
Come on, we almost had him right earlier. What the heck? Six ninety-seven. Can we get to a hundred? They're out of manpower, so they can't replace anything they've got. So, battle steamers, battle barges. Sure, why not? So close, so flipping close, man. They can't move from here. Well, they should probably still move around here. Uh, so close, come on. God dang it, come on. This is a problem about taking out New Victoria. You know what you're going to do? Just keep repairing. And. Come on. Any day now. We should have him. Force the attack. I'm tired of waiting around. You die, you die. Especially when they can't replace themselves. And uh, there you go. Oh, we got over. Thank God. Jesus Christ. That's way too freaking long. Come on. Come on. And now they're all gonna die. Go. Make us happy. Because at the end of the day, don't we all want to be happy? It depends on the day. Okay, most of this done. Nice. Casualties, 500 some versus 7,000. Not enough. Literally not enough. Now they're all here, though. Eh, there's still four planes left. But enough. quite a few of them have been shot down already, which is good. Sure. Good. Make him feel pain. Slowly getting there. And. A think tank is nice. Well, how about some police protection? Agent captured? Well, I'm not super concerned about that right now. Oh no, they're all dying there. Oh, whatever. What's gonna, what's gonna happen? Who cares? That's right. They're all gonna die. Even here. Very nice. This won't matter, but I'm going to do that too. Beautiful. A little disappointed our guy did not get any other abilities, though. But what are, what the hell are you doing? Go through here. It's fine. Good, good, good. <laughs> Cypher's done again, huh? Very nice. Takes a lot of bit of a battle bar, but that's alright. Save a little bit of manpower by using riders instead, but not by much. What do we got here? They're on back. Come back just for you. And we got him. Well, this campaign went lost a lot longer than I thought it would, but we're looking pretty good. Northwest Columbia is looking pretty darn decent. And I guess we have Dan down here, but hey, if you enjoyed the campaign, please consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a tremendous rest of your day.